So this is the sushi bar at Kiku in Paramus and look at all the lovely stuff we've got ready to go for our dinner tonight. And Joseph is going to work for us tonight. He's going to make our specials. Okay, so here I am at the Ama Ebi Festival here at Kiku in Paramus. And I brought with me Mary Beth because last year she plopped one of these shrimp heads in her mouth and she's ready to eclipse her progress. So here we are getting ready to scarf down some sashimi tonight. Stick with it. We're going to start healthy with some seaweed salad and some kimchi. Mm -hmm. And Mimi's Annie serving and, Annie. and what are you? And what's your Annie. Name? Annie. Mimi and Annie are yes. going to be in this video with us. Nice to meet you with you sir. Yes. <laughs> I thought we would start healthy. Very healthy. And then work our way into the tempura. It's very good. Nice and crunchy and healthy. Joseph has uh, arranged our sashimi and tempura. Look at those little shrimp heads waiting for us. So I'm getting ready to start off with some kimchi here. It's um, fermented cabbage and spices. And uh, it's very healthy. Ajumasha soyo. Oh, this is really shaping up to be exquisite. Huh? Mm. See, Joseph is working behind the scenes now and he's making these lovely little things for us to eat. All right, what do we got, Mimi? We got the gyoza. <laughs> All right, oh, gyoza. Right, gyoza. It's good as appetizer. Made yeah, it festival. good. Let's eat Am that. I doing good? You're doing well. Oh, you I, got a speaking part, too. I know, I know. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Oh, you eating every time like that? Yeah, look at this. Okay, as Mary Beth has already made her statement about fried dumplings, but you know how I am with fried foods. Oh. Mm. I guess it's pork inside. You're asking me? Well... It could be gerbil embryos. It's yeah. tasty. It is very tasty. It did go down easy also. Yeah, and it's fried. <laughs> it's fried, yeah. Here we are. Joseph has made our meal. It's ready to go, and he's delivering it right now. Come on. Oh, right. Let's check this thing out. Oh, my mouth is watering already. Look at them. Look at those little shrimp heads. Beautiful. Okay, so here's our dinner and Mary Beth is going to make her selection. What are you going to do first? I'm going to go for the crunchy critter, the sea creature. Oh yes, good for you. And it's the first shrimp head of the year going down. What do you think? Very crunchy. Should I say exquisite? Is it? You like it? Yeah, it's very good. All right. Well. Very good. And that's this is the Ama Ebi Festival, and you're part of it now. Yes. Okay. Everybody gets a chance to make their little dip the way they want to make it, and I certainly like mine nice and spicy. So I add a lot of wasabi into that little soy sauce. So what are you going for? I am uh, going to meet Mr. Shrimp tonight. Hello! Nice to, nice of you to come by for the Ama Ebi Festival. Yes, yes, Mr. Shrimp. I gotta tell you, it only happens once a year. And you gotta be there for it. And you gotta come to Kiku, the only place in town that knows how to make the Ama Ebi for this. And it's wonderful. This is the Yama Ebi. It is the sweet shrimp. And you really should be eating it as sashimi. A little dip. Is it a male or a female? Oh, it's both, actually. No, it's either one or the other. Well, if it bites back, it's a female. <laughs> Good one. All right, here's the Ebi going in. Look at that. Whoa. Mm. 
I can almost hear her purr. How is that? Sweet on the tongue. Sweet shrimp. Excellent. Just like mother used to make, huh? Yes, just like my mom. My mom is a good cook, yes. <laughs> if she could only see me now. <laughs> she will. See me. I'm going to try a piece of this tuna. They didn't have toro today because there's a shortage on tuna. These might be the last fish in the ocean, so bottoms up on that baby. I'm just going to dip a little bit in here. And uh, this is the succulent tuna. <clears throat> Better than filet mignon. Yes, it's time. They've been sitting there long enough. And Mimi's coming back. She thinks she has another speaking part here. I'm just checking if you guys doing okay. Yeah, we're doing fine, Mimi. All right, here Delicious. we go. Yeah, ajo masha soyo. Oh, very good. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, this is a two-hander. Yeah, I gotta pluck the tail off. Oh. I could eat my weight in these little guys. Getting ready to try some red snapping. Oh, you're gonna like that. That is real good. Fine, I'm getting ready to eat some sea bass, and this is the way it should be eaten. Sashimi style. Yum. Oh. It's a um, chewier flesh, and that's probably what, what gets you a little bit. It didn't necessarily melt in your mouth, but it's very tasty. And he left the skin on it, too, which has got all the omega-3s. So this is really a healthy meal. Very yes, good. Yes, you see it first. Harvey yes. eats a, a healthy meal. Right, and he has become healthier. Yes, I have. He, I actually have. He has become healthier, if anybody wants to know. Yes, and everybody wants to know how I get away with eating all that fried food and not putting on 800 pounds. This is a wonderful sweet meat. A little bit of that. Sweet as in... Oh. <laughs> as in delicious. Melts in your mouth. So what do you got okay, for us? Special, sep special. Oh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So Mary Beth is going to try one of these succulent little things. It's so pretty. Look at how colorful. It My is. favorite colors. It's, it's really, it's Red really for Valentine's very pretty. Day. Look at Pink. that. My favorite. What is it? Very crunchy. Look how pretty that is. Look at that. Is that nice? And it's going in my mouth now. Ah, here we go. Mm. That's very good. Do you concur? That is very good. It's sweet. It's got some crunchiness to it. It's got some fresh veggies in there. Oh yeah. What a healthy dinner. I didn't want to miss out on the um, red surf clam, so he just threw a couple of pieces on for me. That is a very good piece of potato guy. Here's this wonderful red surf clam. A little bit of uh, wasabi uh, soy sauce. And... Mm. Oh, it's good to be me, isn't it? Very sweet. Isn't it though? Yeah. Oh, that smells really, mmm. Kimchi-ish? Well, it usually smells like a, um, something decaying and fermenting in the sun on a hot summer day, but... Mood kimchi. Sweet, isn't no, it? No, I say it's sweeter, yes. It is sweeter. Took the word right off my tongue. Mm-hmm. It's sweeter and it has a lot more spice to it. Yes. Very interesting. Mm -hmm. Very I'm good. Not a big mackerel fan. It's chewy, it's oily, it's fishy, but they put it on my plate and I'm not gonna embarrass myself. He's chopped up some stuff on top, including some scallions and I don't know what else he's got on there, but here it goes. Down the old craw. Oh, you know what? It's not that bad. So, uh, tell me, what do you think on a scale of 1 to 10? 
I'd have to say it's a 9.75. Ooh, okay. so we've gotten some tiramisu from the bakery right next door to Kiku, and it looks good. We're gonna give it a shot. That's gonna try this unique looking. Now you've had tiramisu in many places, so how is this compared? Um, I'm gonna give it a shot. Oh, the um, mascarpone is very mm -hmm. airy, very, very smooth. The cookie is um, saturated, it's moist, it's very moist. It's not bad. It's not bad for the Korean version of an right. Italian dish. It's it's not bad, but I gotta tell you, the other night, oh, oh it was wonderful. <laughs>